We're covering all of your family's most embarrassing questions today. We received this email from Mary Catherine in Atlanta about her son. She writes, hey doctors, I've noticed that my son hasn't completely outgrown his drooling habit when he talks or eats. He's 10 years old and the drooling is nothing like when he was a toddler, but I was wondering if it will ever go away completely. And drooling yeah, that, that would is be not uncommon. This is an ask the pediatrician question. <laughs> it's definitely for sure. an embarrassing problem. You know, sometimes it, it might be the picky eaters or the kids with a speech problem. They just mm -hmm. don't have that maturity yet of the swallowing mechanism. Or sometimes it's just their facial muscles are a little bit weak. So as late as age 10, though? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I've seen it, and my boy was getting towards that age, and usually if you, sometimes just uh, simple reminders, hey, go ahead and swallow, you know, and just kind of call their attention. Sometimes they have no idea that they're doing this. Or sometimes uh, some facial exercises can help. Uh, simply having the child drink out of a straw kind of strengthens the lips. Or um, whistles, uh, blowing whistle, or even doing cotton ball races across the table. Blowing. Yeah, blowing cotton balls. And, and they, they think it's a game, but they're actually working on their muscles. I'm so lucky. My kids, the fluids just came out the other end for a long time. <laughs> no, but there is a distinction we need to make here, because chronic drooling is either due to overproduction of saliva or an inability to swallow it. But we have a saying in emergency medicine, mm -hmm. are you able to handle your secretion? So if acutely your child, or even as an adult, mm -hmm. develops drooling, and maybe your voice changes, and you can no longer swallow your saliva, that can be a sign of a deep soft tissue infection. It can be mm -hmm. something called epiglottitis. It can be retropharyngeal yeah. abscess or peritonsillar abscess. Those are actually medical emergencies. Yeah. So, so acute drooling is never normal. Any so sudden get that drooling, checked out. Definitely got to worry about.